So since I've recently purchased one of the new Handtech T0 1000 series scopes, guys, it makes sense to check the Handtech website from time to time, see if there's any updates available. And I noticed that there is a firmware update uh, that is dated for 2023. I assume it to be more current software than uh, what was in the model uh, when I purchased it back in late 2022. So we'll go through the process of updating the firmware. So this is from the settings and then system info page, guys. This is the pre-firmware update uh, details on my scope. Uh, you'll notice nowhere on here does it actually have a firmware reference number. Well, when you do the firmware update, the software number will change. The number within the brackets is going to change. Um, so it's a wee bit confusing. But look at that number under software. The number within the brackets will change post-update. Handtech.com. Go to their homepage. Go scroll down. Tablet oscilloscopes. Latest firmware. See the date? Well, since that's this year, I assume that is more uh, current than what my machine actually came with, which was last year. Download it. So there, it's on my hard drive on my computer. I'm just gonna transfer it. You can see my little tiny thumb drive there. I'm just gonna transfer it over the thumb drive. So now I have the uh, the upgrade package file. Uh, you can see the name of it there on my thumb drive. So I'm now going to take the thumb drive and take it to the scope. Okay, so I highly recommend either 100% certain about the capacity of your batteries or even better, just plug it in for the purposes of the update, right? The home page. Settings. Here is the parameters. So you'll not, so notice nowhere on there does it say um, firmware. There is a software notation. Okay, thumb drive in the USB. <laughs> Yoko, can you keep it down a wee bit there? And go to update. Select update. Updating. Okay, so it appeared to go through the update. Looks like it's going through a reboot. I've customized the, uh, the boot music on mine. Maybe it'll disappear with this upgrade. In which case, I'll go back to the birds chirping. No, I guess not. The volume's at max, so everything's gone back to the factory defaults, I guess. Settings. System info. Sorry about the interruption. That would be uh, priority number one, my dinner. <laughs> Uh, so in software there guys you can see that the software number within the brackets has in fact changed uh, the 22 12 30 decimal zero there uh, from the previous number um, I don't see any um, obvious change to the uh, format or display or uh, clearly it could be anywhere within the workings of the rig right I'll have to um, use the machine a wee bit and see if I can figure out any changes or better yet if anybody else is aware of them by all means put them in the comments so I'll leave it at that voice again home settings on the system info page that's where you'll actually find the details with respect to this and with respect to whether you need an update or not 
That's it, boys. Or I suppose if you're really in the know and you know you're fancy, you can use the the uh, I don't even know what it's called. Quick access code here, QR code or whatever they call it these days. I don't know. That's it, boys. Cheers. <clears throat>